everybody, my name is Julie. Thank you so much for watching. It is Advent calendar time. I am back. Uh, I hope you had a wonderful fourth. I have been not filming for a few weeks, so I'm a little bit rusty, but my floors are refinished. I've come back from vacation and I am ready to dive back in to my project pans. And that is where we're going to start today with an Advent calendar time. <laughs> This is what I'm opening. It is not clearance. It is just 24 products out of my collection. And then I go through and I see, is it worth keeping? Is it worth getting rid of? So on and so forth. And then if it's worth keeping, I roll it into a project pan and I try and use it. So I would say normally say two weeks ago because I open them every two weeks. But we all know I opened it a while ago <laughs> because I've been MIA. Um, but in two weeks in filming time, uh, I have the Vitamin Rich Face Base. This is by Bobby Brown. And I did take this on my vacation with me. This is, you know, good use out of it. I've probably been using this for three weeks, full transparency. And this is quite nice. It's quite nice. I think that it does a good job hydrating. I put it on at night. I can feel the hydration in the morning. Um, I don't see that it really attacks fine lines and wrinkles, but in terms of hydration, which does help fine lines and wrinkles, it is 10 out of 10 good. It does have a vitamin C in it. I think it smells nice. It's not as citrusy as the actual face base, but there is a little citrus in it. It's just not as like biting as the face base, which I also enjoy. But I think that's pretty good product. It's nice and thin. Um, I don't feel like it's so heavy. You can wear it under makeup lightly. I wouldn't like apply a lot like I do at night, but in the morning you just apply it again and it's, it's really nice. And I do use it on the upper part of my eye as well. But um, I don't know. I don't feel like I needed as much up there. For some reason, I feel like my eyes are less droopy than they once were. Is that a weird statement to make? That's probably a weird statement to make, but I just made it. All right. So let's see what I get to play with for the next two weeks. And this really will be two weeks this time. Um, I think if I remember correctly, that was number... Oh, my goodness. That was number... 13 lucky number 13 so now we're on to 14 which is actually number two i'm just gonna take a quick peek in one to make sure i'm right i think i did yes okay that is empty that is officially empty so number two is here so let's see what i skipped last time what are you okay yep i've never tried this product at least i don't remember trying this product this is the skin iceland glacial facial wash with white willow bark that's it right here. Um, I'm pretty sure, well, I know Ulta sells this, and I'm pretty sure something like this would come in like a sample pack that you buy, uh, or not that you buy, but you receive with a purchase. And this says, add water to dime size amount and massage onto face, rinse, avoid eye area. Great. I can do that. Uh, does it say anything else? No, it's just a face wash. Cool. Face wash, as you guys know, take me forever to use up, so I'm excited to have this one and to use it up. I do actually, I'm working on two face washes, three face washes really at the moment. One is an exfoliator and two are just kind of like a normal face wash, one that I took on vacation with me and one that's just been in my shower. I'm going to pull all three of those out, put this one in so we can use it a little bit faster and I'll be back to tell you what I think about it because I have no idea. I don't remember anything about this product if I've even tried it before. I do like the Skin Iceland. They have these amazing patches, these eye patches. Oh my gosh, they were so good. Uh, my Ulta, my last Ulta that I worked at stopped selling them, which is a total bummer because they were that good. But say la vie, Ulta is always changing. But I'll be back in two weeks. I'll tell you what I think. Happy panning, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.